I'll show you how to create a DKIM record in uh, Salesforce. DKIM record is specially formatted DNS text record. It stores the public key the receiving mail server will use to verify message signature. DKIM record displays by name, version, key type and public key itself. It is often made available by the provider that is sending your email. So let's go out to um, Salesforce. Um, so you go to setup, type uh, DKIM in the quick find box, you come up here. There's a button called create new key. Um, it can be uh, 1024 bit or 2048 bit. So I go for um, 1024 bit. Uh, Salesforce uses a DKIM keys to sign outbound emails that your organization sent. Organization sends from your Salesforce platform. A valid signature gives recipients confidence that the email was handled in a way authorized by your organization. Consider industry-specific security regulation or email recipient limitation when choosing the RSA key size. Some regulations such as federal information processing standard require specific key sizes. RSA key for uh, uh, it is an encryption algorithm. Uh, let's see, let's come back to DKIM details. You had to enter uh, selector, is uh, enter the unique name to help identify the DKIM key. I put it as a test DKIM. Alternate selector allows Salesforce to auto generate your DKIM keys a unique name to help identify this DKIM keys. I put some random value domain. The domain name used by your organization for which this key applies. So I put google.com. Domain pattern I put google.com. This is a domain pattern um, description. A comma separated list of domain patterns that uh, domain name must match before Salesforce signs an email with this DKIM key. For example, example.com um, asterisk.example.com uh, so forth. So I'll put just google.com for the sake of this demo and click it. So I created the DKIM key. Um, it says we are in the process of publishing the text record for the TKIM key to DNS so it publishing uh, to DNS in the process of that so this is how you create a DKIM key in Salesforce for outgoing emails